A floating wind turbine is rotating on the surface of the open ocean. It is Hibiki, the next generation floating offshore wind turbine system. Hibiki is characterized by this steel barge type floater and the two blade wind turbine mounted on top of it. Offshore wind turbines are broadly categorized into the fixed bottom platform installed in shallow waters close to shore and the floating platform deployed in deep waters. Hibiki is a floating wind turbine that can be installed in relatively shallow waters of around 50 meters in depth. So let's take a look at the structure that makes this possible. The barge type floater is made by joining block shaped structures together. When the completed floater is placed in the water, it has a shallow draft, allowing it to be floated and towed even inside the harbor. On the other hand, the wind turbine is divided into several parts to begin with. The parts are then mounted on the barge type floater using a floating crane. Let's take a look now at the inside of the wind turbine. This is the part where the turbine is joined to the floater. It's about the same height as a three-story building and a ladder is used to climb up and down it. Around halfway up is a small room lined with machines. Data from sensors installed throughout Hibiki are gathered here. From here, an elevator can be used to climb up or down the tower. The tower rises around 70 meters from the surface of the ocean. Passing through the nacelle housing the generator and climbing to the top of the wind turbine gives panoramic views of the Hibiki Nada area of the port of Kita Kyushu, where Hibiki was assembled. Upon completion, Hibiki was towed approximately 15 kilometers out to sea from the port of Kita Kyushu by boats. Nine anchors were installed here in advance at the bottom of the sea to encircle Hibiki. The wind turbine is tethered to these anchors and chains to prevent it from drifting. A power cable stretching about 15 kilometers from land is also connected to the floater. The role of Hibiki is to demonstrate the low-cost floating offshore wind power generation system suited to the seas of Japan. The effort continues with the aim of putting the system to practical use.